Hi! So I've put together my Midori Traveler Notebook. I think how I'm going to leave it for now and um, we'll see what happens. I This is what it looks like. I have most of the stuff in here. One of the inserts that I didn't put in was the thin paper book because it was blank paper and it came with a blank paper notebook. I think I knew that. I, I don't know. Um, so anyways, this is what it looks like as of now. I have my Lamy Safari in here. Like I've told you uh, in the unboxing of this, my feelings about the Safari have changed. So I'll have to talk about that in a different video. I put the clip on the back originally, but I like it on the front because when I'm writing on it, I'll be writing on the back and I don't want this to, to be under the, the notebook. So um, I affixed the clip to the front and it easily fits the Lamy Safari. It fits the Pilot Metropolitan too, which is a fairly, um, it gets wider in the middle. It's a little snug with that, but um, it works. And so yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, you can see that I've got I've got quite a bit of stuff in here, and it looks like it could still hold more. But I'm not the type of person that has to like totally stuff the notebook. Um, so yeah, I'll show you what it looks like inside. This is literally like maybe five minutes after I unboxed it. It did not take long to put together. I just needed to figure out like where I wanted the the clip to be. One of the other reasons why I put the clip on the front is because in the back. I affixed this pocket to the back of the leather and it affixes really nicely and I didn't want to have the the uh, pen clipped here because then I can't use this pocket so I put this in here so that you could see how it slides in and so this is the back and this is the front and I didn't put the stick on card slots in here yet because I don't exactly know what I want to do with it I was thinking I might put it put one of them in like here, but then if I put it down here, then I can fold paper and stiff it, stick it in that pocket. Oh my gosh. So the first thing I have is the zip envelope, and I put that in the front because I figured if I stuff things in here, I won't have to write on a bumpy surface. So I have that, and then I have the calendar, the free weekly calendar. Then I have the card holder, and so I have my sticker in there from Goulet Pens, and the craft folder, and then the other side of the card holder, <clears throat> and then the notebook that came with it, the plain notebook that came with it, and the back of my zip pocket, which is just a slide in. Oh, you know what? It's two-sided. I didn't realize that before you can slide stuff on both sides. My gosh, I have a million pockets in this thing. And then that. Um, and the way that I put it all in here, you, this is the, uh, the bookmark. So the way that I put it in here was I put the craft folder and the business card holder and the, the zip pocket I put those underneath the band that's actually part of the notebook, which is this. Then I took the band that came on the packaging, the, the box that this was in, and I used that to affix the other two. So I pulled this out so that it was kind of sitting on top. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I put in this notebook and I went in the middle and I went in the middle of this notebook so that it was like all affixed like this. So I don't even know if I'll have to buy the other bands. The only thing is is that this thing is here and I, I suppose I could push it down to the bottom. I didn't even think of that really. But um, that's how I have it affixed for now. And it seems pretty solid like if I go like this nothing's really falling out. It's all kind of hanging in there together. So that's pretty cool. Um, so I just wanted to show you how I had it assembled. I left out the thin page notebook and I haven't yet put in the other stickers. I figure why do I need the thin pages and the blank at the same time? Kind of serves the same purpose. But I don't know. I, I don't know. I think I wanted to see what the thin paper was like. Um, and this all fits nicely around here. 
and with the pen clipped there I can sort of double affix it although this pen loop is not going anywhere it's super snug on there I don't know how big the small one is but I would definitely get the medium one if you're using anything of any kind of consequence I don't even know if that made sense anyways uh, this is the Midori the way that I have it set up and um, it's beautiful it's so this is going to sound really stupid. It's hand friendly. Like you want to hold it. You want to you want to touch it because it's really soft. It's supple. It's bendy. It's a nice thick piece of leather. You know, I don't know how good the value is for the size leather. I've I priced out some other things that looked really nice, but I I ended up with this one and it's really nice. So, um I think I'm going to go let it sit outside for a little while so that that smell can go away. Um but it's beautiful and I'm excited that I finally got it and I can't wait to start using it. So I hope that you found this helpful. Have a nice day. It's beautiful here. I hope it's beautiful where you are. Bye.